We are back again with mission eight. So here we go. Once we start the level, just move forward and go to the building to the left. I know there's loads of buildings to the left. Once you get into this specific building, jump over and drop down. You'll find your first gold bar located as soon as you drop. Now for bar number two. Jump back over where we came from and continue on down the street. Or what's left of it. And there'll be a building to the right. Of course, there's a load of buildings. Go through the door here and you'll find your second bar located to the right. Bottle number one. So once you go out on the street once again, you will find a sniper dash clock tower in the far, far distance. Shoot the bottle located inside. Bottle number two, look to the right. On the side of this building, you will find number two. Gold bar number three. Making things simple from the last location, go past, past sorry, the first car, go through the building here and take the door to the right and take another door to the right and then go through to find your next bar. Number four. Now, once you leave the building, I'll recommend going the back the same way we came from, just to save more time. Go underneath the plane wing and go right. You will find a drop off point that you cannot come back up once you dropped, but there is another route that you can go to get back up so there's no biggie. But in this room here, you will find your next gold bar. There's two ways you can get this, or loads of ways actually, but I decided to go back because you can actually see the bottle when you go up these stairs here. It's located on the downed plane. Once you collected that, move on. So now once you're looking at the down plane from the front, you will be in a crossroad section, forward, left or right. If you look to the right, that's where your main objective is. In amongst all these boxes, you will find one of them holding a bottle on top. Number five. Once we start, head left on the crossroad. And the building in the corner on this crossroad, you will find your next bar. Go through the door and look left. Now from the last location, turn around, go through the door and just stick to the left and then make a jump up here and then you'll drop down and you should hopefully see the glowing bar to the left here. Now once again, make things so simple, the last location, jump back over, leave the building and head left. Now for this one, there will be a building off to the right hand side, go through the double doors, ignore the stairs, take a right, go for the next door, and in the corner here to the left, you will find number seven. So number eight, now we're going to head back to the crossroads. So now once we head back, to where the crossroads is now all we need to do now is go straight and head towards our objective marker but don't actually go towards it completely so we're back at the crossroads follow the objective marker say to the right here you will find a building to the right that has some stairs that we need to go up it is pretty damn close towards the objective marker so go in go up the stairs take a left and you will find the gold bar next to the cabinet and doorway. Gold bar number nine. Head downstairs, go straight. Go past the objective marker to the right and go into the building to the left. This is where you find gold bar number nine. Bottle number five. Once you go into the objective marker area, go down the uh, slope, you will find your last bottle of this level on the metal beam above. 
Now, once you have defeated all the enemies that come at you, take the second doorway to the right. This door will be unlocked. Once you go inside, behind the door, you will find your final gold bar. See you guys and girls in Mission 9.